something about you and David or is that true? That's my boy, man. Come on. <laughs> That's my boy. So it's all like a big massive rumor. Yeah, I, I think I think it's just like the um, the fans, you know, I think it's entertainment to them. They're just trying to create something, you know. So oh, you hope you guys are doing well. The boys are fighting. This is like the first time I've seen whiskey dragged someone with whatever, you know, like I better pass my neighbor generator. He dragged the video. And I'm so glad that video did not respond to whiskey. This is really crazy. I was waiting to really find out what is going on. Why are they fighting? But I'm happy I eventually get to know what really caused their fight. Why whiskey that never say anything, no matter how much they dragged him on social media. Whiskey will not respond. I always say that, ah, why can't David be like Whiskey? But I thought, mm, everybody with their own way of managing stuff. I think Davido just like the clout. Whiskey knows that his fans are going to drag everyone. And no matter what, the clout is going to come to him. But Whiskey is doing the dragging by himself this time around. You guys. Baby, Debbie, Debbie, rocking her style. She knows all the great fashion trending in town. When it comes to town, that's not all. She's very wise and intelligent. She knows what she wants. So subscribe. Hello and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time, you are welcome. If you have been watching but you're still contemplating, should you subscribe or not? What are you waiting for? Please click the subscribe button down below and turn on the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever I upload a video. If you can hear some rasp in my voice or I eventually cough while I'm doing this video, just know that I'm not feeling very fine, but we move. We move. Anyway, you guys, like I said, JJ and JJ, JJ, I sit down for a while. So somebody contacted me, ah, ah, you didn't see what is going on. Whiskey is dragging that video. I said, ah, really? What is that? And they sent me this. This is the first one I saw. Then I realized, oh, it's been going on for some hours but let me read this one that i saw say first off you are not as fly as me that is whiskey to davido you can't sing or make music like me you can't dress you don't make more money than me you don't even go holes like me you don't know yourself you are cheap you pull up for less than we do now f off you spoil rich child <laughs> you, you spoil rich child uh uh f you and your daddy's money we got ours every nigga around you broke you dumb ass oh my god i can't even go on with this thing like it's too much flies with you everywhere dressed like basket mouth lol our lawyers are too busy for the ish you kids and i'm gonna post everything uh whiskey because ah, some of these things are so vile i can't even read them you can see the way i'm omitting all of this thing but i'll put it up there and why i read that one is when i said ah, basket mouth i said ah, basket mouth sit down jj stone go meet basket mouth for head where he sit down what is going on then someone said oh the reason why basket mouth came in was i'm gonna post that as well but i still remember that it was when davido was getting married and i think someone was talking about whiskey and uh, basket man literally shared whiskey i think that is why <laughs> whiskey decided to put basket mouth in it and basket mouth also responded by you know showing him dressing up because uh whiskey literally said that the video is, is dressed like basket mouth like all the people following that video are always dressing like basket mouth and basket mouth was just i'm like oh is jj jj whiskey sit down for that time when the video was celebrating his wedding that you throw stone i'm thinking what could cost this you know in the industry it has always been a norm sorry my my eyes is watery. I'm, I have a very bad cold. So in the industry, it's always been a norm for these people to fight. And I like analysis that someone posted about uh, Sikira in the barista, Polinti, how these two friends became, you know, real enemy and they were fighting each other. And it's simply because... Uh, uh this speak someone came in between them and you know and before you know it these two jolly friends they become sworn enemy they fought for over 20 years 
and it was really really bad and this thing has been going on if you notice the line of wasua in there and stuff as well he is always in one news or the other you know pasuma and all of that i'm happy that this fuji whatever they calm down and now is the e-pop with you know dami crane always coming into everything that has to do with davido and another thing that I noticed that Whiskey did was shade Davido's uncle. Literally said that his own uncle is not going to be dancing on social media or whatever. There is nothing wrong in this governor dancing. I'm not in support of whatever Whiskey has said. But allegedly, he was said that this is what caused the entire fight and i'm going to end it there i'm just going to you know tell you what someone said caused the fight i tried to investigate and i noticed that oh it's true davido is now their ambassador so apparently whiskey was with puma whiskey has been riding with puma and everything and the contract ended as ambassador and it's time for renewal and whiskey request requested for more money and puma wasn't you know playing ball and everything i think the person said that the the contract was like a million dollars and whiskey requested for 10 million now and i'm thinking oh my god that's outrageous obviously there is inflation there's everything going on around the world right now <coughs> so all of a sudden davido i don't know whether it's davido's pr or whatever you know all of these people they always press and look for more and more and more so eventually they said davido accepted for less of what whiskey is asking for i don't know how much and before you know it whiskey wasn't having his whiskey went wide uh, if i'm saying wide things that whiskey were saying like you won't believe that is somebody that doesn't say stuff on social media it was really wide because he said oh this uh niggas does business with investors that's come online to speak each can't make up how foolish that old team is nigeria is placed the rich weaponized poverty so you carry all these broke boys in real life and get them visa so they worship you and not tell you about yourself call you zero zero one you delusional f i hear i hear you idiot the only time you are 001 is when you are in your house. You are not 001 of nothing but Instagram followers. You don't make money than anybody in Nigeria in music. Cheap guy, everything about you scream. Things he was saying, even his follower were like, you know, hailing him, psyching him up to do more. And he was doing more, even his followers and Davido followers are coming for him as well. I just think this is literally crazy, especially when I saw the history of Barista and collinton where is barista now barista is gone collinton is still there and i know collinton will be somewhere thinking like ah oh my god i wish the time that me and my friend were supposed to bond for that 20 years we were friends we were not fighting someone did not come in between us years ago when he was calling uh davido his boy even though some people were saying oh he shouldn't have done that how old is he but i think Calling someone my girl or my home girl doesn't mean that I'm older than the person. It just means that that's my personal person, like my boy, my girl, my homeboy is like a slang. But these people still try to, you know, take things out of it. I just hope they can come together and sort this out among themselves because see oju anu tell you for life like the 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 space is more than enough for for these two big artists anyway i wish them luck and i hope god will grant them wisdom to navigate this beef and you know let it go anyway you guys i want to hear what you think about this entire beef in the comment section below guys do you think whiskey is in his right to drag the video simply because of that deal of puma or do you think he is doing too much i want to hear what you guys think in the comment section below guys and on your way out don't forget to give this video a thumbs up share if you like it if you haven't please hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell and i will see you in the next one bye about you and david is that true that's my boy man come on <laughs> that's my boy so it's all like a big massive rumor yeah I, I think i think it's just like the um the fans you know i think it's entertainment to them they're just trying to create something you know so subscribe and get that juice with the one and only debbie Fashta. yeah yeah